What's up, YouTube? It's Toron coming at you another episode of our Feed the Bees Let's Play. And today we're messing around with the modular force field system. Um, I've already created a couple things, the capacitor and some extractors. Uh, the extractors use this recipe. And then the capacitor uses this one. As you can see, I made some plans in case I want to add more of these later. Um, what I do need to do now, though, is make some upgrades. Let's see. And range. We're going to need a few of these. Let's see. What am I missing? Oh, carbon plate, huh? Um, oh, wait. Booster. Oh, I forgot. I gotta make me some more carbon plate soon. Um, we already made a def Oh wait, we haven't made the defense station yet. Let's make that before we forget. One defense station. And... Uh, what's the booster? Oh wait. Um, I think we can use 16 of these. Alright. So now, we'll take this and leave. Go back over here. And... Make some more of those. Okay, yeah, 9 is the most you can have in the stack, so we need to make 7 more. Do I have any more carbon plates? I do have some more, but I think we need it for something over here. We already have a security station made. I'll show you guys that. Converter I don't need right now. Okay, so I can take the carbon plate from here. Wait, I have 60 in my inventory too. Derp -de -der. All right. Seven. That extends the range for both. Oh, it's only... I'm retarded. I admit it right now. I'm not thinking. Alright. I only need to increase the range of the capacitor, not everything. Oh, yo, yo. Oh, wait, we need a few of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think about six is what we'll need. Um. Let's see, is that the one I think it is? Yep, we need a bunch of these for distance. I think the most a spot can have. Oh, we need more projector focus matrix. Haha. -ha. And build another 64 of those. And do, 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 do. go back to this one. No. All right. And we need. All right. Let's make a few of these first. Extractor and capacitor. These ones are the ones I need a ton of. We'll build six for now. And we'll build another 64 of those. And we'll build... I think we can do one more there. All right. And... Are we missing anything? Oh, yes, I had made some security station cards. To link to it. Oh, there's the other crystals that we need. So we can make some more of these. Nine. I am going to need more crystals, though, apparently.
I think I only need one more crystal for this. Uh, that would be this one. I'll take a crystal. And then come over here. No, that's four now. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. I need five more. Two, three, four, five. All right, we'll toss those for now. All right. And put you guys back up here. And give me all those. Oh, I ran out of carbon plate. But we have some more still. I'm going to have to make a ton more of that stuff because I keep using it for this. All right, nine, nine. Perfect. And get these. Get those. All right, let's go throw these. Um, all right, so what I've done here is I have my two extractors down here. As you can see, they're filling up with power. I don't have them linking yet to anything, which I need to put down the capacitor to link them to. So I'm wondering if I should put the capacitor down here. Um, so this can go here. Oh, I forgot. I need I need to make nine more of those. Ugh. And apparently I need to make eight more boosters. All right, those are capacitor upgrades. I wasted nine of them. Um, can't do anything with that. So I need security cards for those, just the other devices. Okay, that was lame. Um, this is going to be extractor one. And this will be extractor two. All right, extractor one, extractor two. And I need to hook this up to the, the one station. I need to make more of those and more of those first. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make more of these things and um, get that done. And I'll be back with you guys momentarily. All right, everybody, I'm back, and I've decided to put the capacitor and the defense station up here. Um, I went ahead and created the appropriate modules, um, and I've also gone ahead and created a multi-tool. What I do need to do is create an ID card. Come over here. We'll throw it in this. Give me all the privileges. Because I am awesome. There we go. I'm the master. Um, what I've also done here is set it up so that I can manage from one location the different things. I still need to go and do... Um, uh, I need to set up the extractors so I can manage them remotely. Um, but... Uh, security station I can manage everything from here um, which makes it nice and one more of these come over here and boom all right so now if we go and turn it on the defense station Go ahead and turn it on. It's set to kill any NPCs in the area that are hostile. We should no longer see anything spawning. Spiders, wisps, nada. 
which is going to be nice. That means we can sit outside without any worries. Let's go ahead and set up. I'm going to need another card. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and set up um, the extractors to be remotely managed. And which one had the cards? Um, no. Card. That's what I want. I need one more of you. Okay. Um, it took me probably about an hour or so to get everything else together and to wait. I had to build, make more carbon and all that fun, annoying stuff. So, link, link. Fabulous. So now we go back to our lovely, actually, you know what? Aha, I can cheat. And now we come back up here to our oh, no, security station to this one. And we can throw these in here. And now, if we go like this, and come over here and go like, yaw, yeah, we can open it and set it to be managed this way. And of course, it is on. And we can do the same thing for extractor 2. Go into it. And set it to be managed this way. This just makes it really nice for us. So now we can manage it all from one central location. Uh, we don't have to run to the uh, to each one to manage it. And as we add devices, it'll be easier to maintain and manage. Uh, let's see. So we just gotta wait for the power to for it to gain more power. Oh, which means maybe we might need to go back over to our lovely base here. Let's check on our extractors. Still going. Still going. So we'll let that process and uh, we'll come back to it here momentarily. Well, we'll just let it process and save up power. But this should help keep at least some of the bad animals at bay. Let's check on this. We have too much sand, which means we're out of hummus. And come back. One, two, three, four. The trees are full almost. All right, Gundaba. So we we pretty much made it so we won't have to deal with many mobs in the area as long as that maintains power. Uh, beyond that. Um, I want to start doing some stuff in there. I want to make our storage room, but I want to make it out of warded stone. And so we're going to need to do some thong crafts, uh, thong craft stuff. So give me a minute here and I'll get ready to head over to our workshop and we'll do a little thong craft together. We can be back with you guys momentarily. All right, everybody, we're back now. Here is the workshop. Just a little building out here. I have a... You know, lots of lovely mobs around us, but oh well. Um, I created the uh, the cauldron, little table, some water, um, the home book to get back, our chest with stuff that I brought over, uh, stuff that was here before that I found, and of course this is where I keep the thumb and the namakan, which is this baby right here. And as you can see, I haven't got much yet of anything. And I did start this. Oh, no, not that one. This one. I started with paper. And so now we're going to add to this. All right, oh, and I'm back. Thing. That was the uh, good old mom calling to check up on me and see how I'm doing. 
So as we were here, I gotta go kill that spider. Come on, spider. Wow, there's two of them. No wonder it was so annoying. All right, back to the table. So let's see if this. Oh wait, what what are we set at? Let's do thorough. Oh, well, looks like we're going to use that. And we need we need wheels. Wheels, wheels, wheels. And I know I brought some stuff for wheels. Or not wheels, but gears, I mean. Yeah, gears. Let's see somewhere. Ah, redstone. And Ta-da! We have discovered the thermometer. You believe this mythical device will point you in the direction of nearby sources of mystical energy. Ta-da! All right. <clears throat> now let's see. Next, I think we'll just go with the shard. Okay, and then another shard. Nope. What about some redstone? No. Oh, enchanted fabric. That's probably going to want some wool. Just a guess. Oh. And once. It's a fabric. Oh. Needs the anvil, huh? All right. Let's see here. So what I'm trying to do basically is get myself some warded blocks. Um, really? Of all the things I don't have here, a crafting table is what I don't have. And of course, I don't have any wood. Alright you guys, I'm going to go get a crafting table and I'm going to work on some uh, uh, Thomcraft and then I'll be back with you guys to show you what I've gotten managed to do. I will be right back. Alright you guys, I'm back and I just discovered Nitor. And, ta-da! So while you guys are gone, I discovered Alumentum, Nitor, uh, the enchanted fabric, of course, and the thermometer we did. And we've also discovered the robes. Um, what I'm hoping to do is to get down here where we start getting into the warded stuff so I can get to the, the warded blocks. I want to do the uh, warded stone, which hopefully is like there or something, which I'm hoping... I'll get soon. But that's going to be it for today, you guys. Um, I'm going to call again and get this video up online. I appreciate everybody that watches these. Um, if you guys want to see some more detailed Thomcraft, um, let me know. Otherwise, I'm just going to keep working on it privately until I get to where I want to be. Um, but you guys are awesome again. Thank you so much for all your support, and I will talk with you guys later. Take care, everybody. Peace.